And we'll get to more on that in just a minute. But first, action tonight out at the BNP Paribas Open with the Eisenhower Cup. Sports Director Blake Arthur live in studio with more on this always exciting event. Blake. Yeah, Kara, thank you so much. The Eisenhower Cup, a tiebreak tens event, took center stage under the lights tonight at the Indy Wells Tennis Garden inside Stadium 2. This year's edition consisted of a mixed doubles format for the very first time. Pretty cool. Headlined by American star Taylor Fritz, reigning champion on the single side, and top-ranked Polish star Iga Swiatek. Both had their champion's murals unveiled today for fans to see. That's one of the cool traditions and tributes that makes this tournament so special for the players and the fans. But as far as the tiebreak 10s Eisenhower Cup, Fritz and Arena Savalenka won it all, taking home the trophy and the $200,000 check. I love mixed doubles because the women can be just as hard in their game as men. I've played a lot of mixed doubles in my years. Hey, maybe next year Karen and I will get out there and team up and win $200,000. Then we can retire, huh, Katie? Yeah. Hey, I mentioned the, uh, the check. To the winners, proceeds from the event will benefit local charitable organizations. So a win-win for all. Another great addition of the always fun Eisenhower Cup. And look, just the beginning. We're going to have much more coverage of the BMP Paribas Open over the next two weeks. That's both on air and online at KESQ.com. And that includes tomorrow, Wednesday, one of the best days of the two weeks. It is the start of main draw action, but it is also media day. We'll have the chance to interview some of the top players in the sport at this year's tournament. So be sure to stay with us right here for that. Reporting live in studio, Blake Arthur, News Channel 3. Okay, Blake, thank you. We'll see you next year at that tennis tournament.